Hi, welcome to this edition of Max Muscle Minute. Um, myotonic disorders, myotonia in particular, again, a broad term um, that might encompass several subsets of disorders um, that relate to um, the inability of uh, skeletal muscle to contract and then relax. And sometimes there's weakness associated with that as well. And so after rigorous contraction um, with uh, myotonia, you can't relax your muscle, and so you feel very stiff and rigid. And um, this may go away after you know several contraction uh, and attempted relaxation sequences, um, which is sometimes called warming up in the literature. And so it's a real problem because uh, exercise might actually induce a myotonic event and create stiffness uh, both acutely uh, and chronically 24 hours later or more. And so you've got to be very careful exercising if you have um, myotonia um, because it can become very uncomfortable because of the uh, sustained muscle contraction and the inability to relax after a particular exercise um, is performed, uh, let alone what might happen in the next 24 to 48 hours uh, as part of the body's recovery process and dealing with um, what's happening at the chemical level uh, with these ion channel um, based myotonic uh, diseases. So again, um, these muscle diseases are very difficult to work with and treat, but uh, if you know what you're doing, exercise um, may be able to help a little bit. Just got to be careful again, dose and response.